Okay, so this is a vlog just to keep you guys updated and stuff going on. But first, I want to get something out after this. Unreal better be a grateful fucking dickwad, motherfucker, because... Here's the, sh here's the stuff I bought for him. And when it's gonna get delivered, you better be fucking... You better be fucking grateful, because people are giving me weird looks in the store. Not really, but... Here's the first thing I got for him. You don't know what it is, but it's a Code Geass uh, mantle. Uh, at this one store I was browsing through, and, um... Yeah, it was a mantle. It wasn't the... It wasn't the uniform. It was actually a mantle with holes in it, which... Which looked kind of weird, but when you see someone put it on, it actually looks pretty... Pretty, um... It looks pretty cool, actually. But... I mean, I would have preferred it if uh, it was just the mantle. <sighs> really? Then, uh... Then here's Unreal's... Here, here, have a closer look at your green-haired bitch. Yeah, there's his other gift. His boot pad. Jesus Christ. And so yeah, when I get it delivered to him, he better be a grateful motherfucker. Or I'm gonna kill him, because that cost around $60, which, um, is bullshit. I could've bought a new game for it with that. Did I get anything else? Would this count? I got this. I got an airsoft gun. I saw it in the store for three dollars. I was like, I was like, this fits my hand. This fits my hand, so I bought it. So to use as a prop, because I'm making videos for you guys, and I and I always wanted um. Well, actually, I was always fascinated with like guns as a kid. Like just you know, you know, bang, bang, bang everywhere. So yeah, this one fits my hand, and I'm gonna use it as a prop and as a costume for for myself. So now Positivo can take the SMG, which is kind of childish, but eh, now I have three guns. It shoots bullets too, but um, I'd rather kind of not, cause. I already lost the first bullet because I stuck it in too far, thinking it might have been a good idea, but it wasn't. But on to the next topic. Next topic is the reviews. Okay, the next review is a big review, so that's why it's taking a while to get on because I'm I'm scripting, I'm, I'm editing, I'm editing the th um, the video right now. It's like 30% done or 40. It's somewhere around there. It's less than half. And, um, yeah, it's being edited right right now. I'm trying to get around to it if I'm not distracted by the new stuff that's happening and the old stuff that I never heard about. Like, uh, I was reading this one book. It was called Potimayo. And, uh, well, I didn't know there was, an, there was a cartoon about it. And so I went straight to watching the cartoons, and it's very faithful to the book. And I like it. That's what's been distracting me. I try not to get distracted, but I can't help it. And then there's that new shitty show, um, what was it? Oma Mori Imari? I, I think when I, when I was watching that, my balls just dropped. There's gonna be a commentary on that with Snake and so forth. But, um, yeah. So, review is coming. A big one is coming, so that's why it's taking a while. Like, I, I could pull out a short right now by getting the... Positivo costume and just reviewing like a good game in like less than five minutes So it's coming be patient What next? Oh, yes, uh, I don't know if I should throw this out, but um Mega Man Abridge, he's also Canadian too um, He wants to have a partnership with uh, River City Gamers and I said okay Now we have our own team four star <laughs> No, not really not really. I'm not a jackass. I don't compare things unless you suck dick and you look like you suck dick. But anyways, yeah, there's a partnership going on with him. Uh, we'll promote each other, sort of. So, yeah. What else is 
what, what else is going on? I did not write this down, so you know what? Fuck you for saying like, a, oh, maybe you should write down notes. I'm trying not to stick my teeth out because it looks really stupid. What was it? Oh yeah, and then thanks to Unreal, now I don't have the money to like get the all weekend uh, ticket to Anime North because I do want to go. Although the all weekend thing was kind of um, uh, a maybe kind of thing because I intended to only go Saturday. But um, Blonde Guy Gamer it's pretty much coming to there, so I'm, I'm like, okay, I'm going. Um, Zero Master, he's going too, so I'm like, uh, okay, I'm going. And a few of my buddies and someone from the Spoonie forums. Uh, I don't know, I forget who he was, but I'm going to go check up on that. Uh, SCR may come. If he does come, I'll get the, like, the weekend uh, thing. Uh, if not, I'll just get the Saturday thing, because, you know, I, I live practically like... 15 minutes by car. Like, like I was so shocked when I found out that, that convention was like, was like practically just like five blocks away. Okay, it's not that close, but you know, it's close enough that I know where it is, which is creepy as hell. And then I'm wondering like, how come I don't see all those cosplayers running by my neighborhood? Um, what was happening? happening? Any new games I'm looking forward to? Uh, hmm. I'm not too impressed with how Dark Void looks. I was watching um, uh, that one user, Eagle MF. Um, he's probably gonna say some, something like, uh, "Yeah, that guy with the Nathan." Uh, who, who the fuck was that bald guy from Resistance? Um, no, it's not Armag Twenty One, as he's gone insane by this point. Nathan Hale, yeah, with the Nathan Hale picture. Yeah, I saw him playing it, and I was not too impressed with um, how the game looks. I wasn't even impressed the first time I saw it in my Resident Evil 5 copy. I want to get back to the conventioning thing. Um, yeah, so now I don't have to $55 to go for the um, weekend weekend event. Because, uh, you know, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, that's that's the weekend deal at $50, $55. And, uh, oh, after looking at Zero Master's collection of what he got this, like, last year, that, that wooden band, that wooden sword, I, I want that shit, I want that shit. N Mr. N Mr. N's gonna get that. I, and I'm not sure if many of you would, were enjoying Mr. N as he, as he bitches about everything he sees. Because that's the point of him, his character. Uh, I need to do more of that, actually. I, I actually had a bunch of footage shot for him, but I was like, uh, delete. Cause I, Cause I keep forgetting to rough up my hair, which I now cut since yesterday. So, um, yeah, that's... According to Zero, that sword was like $20. Um, okay, I... That means I'll need 75. Okay, 55, 75, assuming it's the same price. And then I do want to, want to go to that May Cafe. I wanted to go last year, but I did not... I had no knowledge of that. I'm gonna have to ask uh, Chibity about that. And um, I looked at it this time, it was $15. And yeah. And I think I, and, and I finally know where the gaming room is. Now that I asked uh, my buddy Ryan, he's like, oh, it's at the back of the hotel. I'm like, mm, thanks. Thanks, um, Anime North. Uh, you are so wonderful. But, anyways, yeah. That, that's pretty much uh, all I can think of right now. I'll update you whenever I have some big news. Well, all that. Stay tuned for more.